Hello students, welcome back. Let us continue with uh, solve examples on page 12 related to uh, real number and the decimal expansions. So we need to show that 0 0.2353535 which is equal to 0 0.235 a bar on 35 can be expressed in the form p upon q where p and q are integers and q is not equal to 0. So we are going to follow the same strategy that we used in the previous two examples. Let's go ahead and solve the sum. I'll say solution. I'm going to say let my x be equal to point 2, 3, 5, 3, 5 and so on. Now two numbers are repeating which is 3 and 5, right? So I'm going to multiply both the sides with 100 because two digits are repeating after the decimal. So multiplying both sides by 100, what do I get? 100 x is equal to 23.5353 and so on. Now I need to split 23.5353 and so on in such a way that one number should be x which is 0.235535 and so on. So how am I going to do this? I will write this as 23.3 plus point two three uh, two three five three five three and so on right so when you add these two numbers see what you will get the number before the decimal is going to be 23 and after the decimal let's calculate so what do i get five three five three five three which is the number after the decimal so this can be further written as 23.3 plus x okay now i'm going to take my x on the left hand side because I have 100x x here so similar terms on one side I will say 100x minus x is equal to I can write 23.3 as 233 upon 10 correct so this will be 99x is equal to 233 upon 10 x is here getting multiplied with 99 so 9 will come here and divide what does this number become x is equal to 233 upon 10 into 99 which can be further written as 233 upon 990 so this is my x which is equal to 0. 2, 3, 5 and a bar on 3, 5. So I have represented this number, the rational number 0 0.235, th a bar on 3, 5 in the form P upon Q. Take a look, P upon Q where both these numbers are integers and 990 is not equal to 0. That is Q is not equal to 0. So let us look at the second example. Find an irrational number between 1 upon 7 and 2 upon 7. Now we see, in, uh, we saw in the previous examples that 1 upon 7 is nothing but 0 0.142857 bar, bar from 1 to 7. That means this, these 6 digits are going to repeat in a loop one after the other, okay, in a pattern. Similarly, we can find the value of 2 upon 7, which is nothing but 2 into 1 upon 7, which is 2 into 0 0.142857 bar. So let us calculate this. I get 0 0.142857 into 2, which is equal to 2 7s are 14, 2 5s are 10, 11, 2 8s are 16, 17, 2 2s are 4, 5, 2 4s are 8, 2 1s are 2, 1 2 3 4 5 6. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, I get a decimal here. So 2 upon 7 is equal to 0 0.285714. So a bar. Okay. So now we need to find a number such that 
it lies between these two number and it is irrational now we have infinite number of rational number irrational numbers between these two because the pattern is not going to repeat so let's say one of these could be i have 0.1428 5796321 the list is endless okay then i have 0.27568423976682 see nothing is repeating okay after the decimal i have there's no pattern whatsoever even here there is no pattern whatsoever right let me just replace this by 1 so even 60 i initially had 68 i replaced the 8 with 1 so there is no pattern whatsoever and the number of digits after my decimal is countless which is which makes this an irrational number lying between these two numbers that is these two numbers are lying between 1 upon 7 and 2 upon 7 so there, therefore we conclude that there are innumerable number of rational irrational numbers between any two given numbers right so with this we uh, we wind up our solved examples we will continue with the exercise related to real numbers and the expansions in the next class thank you hope this video increased your knowledge for more such videos and a completely free educational content log on to www.epathshala.org or visit our epathshala youtube channel we have each and every question solved for maths physics chemistry and biology so subscribe our channel share with your friends like our facebook page and follow our twitter handle for regular updates and important educational tips and also win epathshala goodies So what are you waiting for subscribe this channel and enjoy the freedom of education